Hello. In today's video, we will be going over the Rhode Island Works program. It's a Rhode Island cash assistance program. And just for a disclaimer, we are not professionals and the information provided is to the best of our abilities from the Rhode Island State website. What is Rhode Island Works? The Rhode Island Works program, previously the Family Independence Program, offers temporary cash assistance, child care assistance, transportation, and employment services such as barrier migration, education, job training, and or employment. The goal of this program is to build up families through supportive services, education, and training so that they can enter a pathway to economic independence. And for eligibility, you must be a Rhode Island resident and a U.S. citizen, legal alien, or qualified alien. You must also be unemployed or underemployed and have low or very low income. And you also must be one of the following. Have a child 18 years of age or younger, or be pregnant, or be 18 years of age or younger and be the head of your household. And here are the ways to apply. You can apply online. It is probably the quickest way to do that. You can also apply by mail. And we will link the PDFs in the different languages to the Rhode Island Works application below. You can print these out and you can mail them to the Rhode Island Department of Human Services. And this is the address or whichever location is posted on the application. You can also use these PDFs as a guide to see what questions will be on the online application. So you can take a look at the qu potential questions and what documents you may need. And finally, you can also look at your local Department of Health Service office to apply. Uh, let's take a look at the website for online. This is the website to apply online. It says it saves time by doing so. And if you choose to look at the PDF as a guide, it will give you some examples of the documents you may need to provide for your interview or some of these documents you need, may need to uh, submit. And it tells you more things. We will link this down below. With this application, you are also al allowed to apply for multiple things at the same time and they will let you know whether you qualify, such as for SNAP or the Child Care Assistance Program and more. And some of the things you need to apply, we just saw, but they will ask for your proof of identity, citizenship, or your immigration status. They may ask for proof of your income, such as pay stubs and tax returns, as well as your assets and resources and any expenses. For any next steps, once you complete the application and you are eligible, you can look at this participation guide for more information, and we will link this down below. And for an important note, if you receive Rhode Island Works as a result of an error in your eligibility, this results in overpayment. If you were overpaid, you will have to pay back the money to the Department of Human Services you can pay the overpayment back using your credit or debit card. Now for some alternative options. If you not, do not qualify for Rhode Island Works, it's difficult to qualify for SNAP, but it is still possible to qualify for SNAP. So you can still try to apply through the application. If you do not qualify for either, you can look at the local food bank in Rhode Island. For more information, you can visit this website and we will link it below. For more resources and videos about Rhode Island or some other states, you can go to this website here. We will link it below. And here is our contact information. We also have other videos on SNAP, um, unemployment, and more. Thank you for watching, and we hope this was helpful.